So we know that inflation is an increase in the price level, which makes goods more costly for us to buy. But if we get an annual raise in salary, that doesn't bother us much, does it? But how do we know if our salary increase is keeping up with inflation? We can make a distinction between our nominal income and our real income. Our nominal income is the current dollar amount of a person's income. It's the amount in our paycheck. Our real income has been adjusted for price changes. So this is very similar to what we saw with nominal GDP and real GDP. Real GDP, we were taking price out of the equation. We adjusted it for price changes. We can do the same thing with income. So we can calculate our real income from year to year to see if we're indeed still getting more money or if our raise is being um, consumed by the higher prices associated with inflation. For example, let's say our salary in year one is $50,000. And then we get a raise and our new salary is $52,500. That's an increase of $2,500. Not too bad. But let's look at real income now. If the CPI in year one is 140 and the CPI in year two is 145, then inflation has been modest. It's been 3.5%. We've done that by calculating the percentage change um, from 140 to 145. So 3.5% is relatively modest inflation. But what's happened to our real income? If we calculate the real income in year one, we take our nominal income and divide it by the CPI in year one. So we take 50,000 divided by 140, multiply it by 100, and that gets us a real income of 35,714, okay? In year two, we've gotten our raise. Um, so we're gonna calculate it as that new salary of 52,500, but now we're going to divide it by the, the CPI in year two, which is 145. Again, multiplying by 100. Now our real income is 36,208. So that's only a real increase of $494. Okay, inflation has eaten away quite a bit of that 2,500, hasn't it? Mm-hmm. And what if the inflation rate had been higher, say about 70, excuse me, about 7%. Instead of going to 145, what if it went to 150 in terms of CPI? If the CPI in year two was 150, then our real income in year two is now 52,500 divided by 150 multiplied by 100. Now our real income has dropped to $35,000. Now we've actually lost money in terms of real income. So it can be kind of important to understand um, what inflation is doing in terms of our purchasing power and to be thinking about, okay, are we really keeping up with inflation? So that's one of the ways that we can use the CPI um, and think about inflation and thinking about adjusting um, things like income to do that sort of analysis.